is all about the blogs and the blogging resources. So, it is what is blog? So, blog is website that contain online personal reflection, comments, and often hyperlink provided by the writers. So, the second is subscribing to blog. First is email. So, what is email? Email is a means or system of transmitting message electronically as between the computer on the network. Some blogs allow users to subscribe by simply by simply entering entering the email address. Okay, here is example of email. So first is enter a username and password, then the following server. The next is the RSS. So what is RSS? RSS is feeds as an alternative way to subscribe to the website and blog you visit regularly. So, uh, RSS is the feed's alternative way to subscribe the website and blogs you visit regularly. And the RSS is stands for a simply, really simple syndication. Uh, of course, the, the acronyms can be explained in many other creative ways. So, the next is... Classroom 2.0 Action uh, There are many websites on internet where educators can write their own blogs. One way to do this uh, is become part of an organization that provides is The first is the Classroom 2.0. The next is the EduCoast. The EduCoast is model of enable uh, convenient, convenient on-demand network to a uh, share full or configurable computing resources. Uh, uh, let's back to the classroom 2.2. So, classroom 2.2 is can be defined as the open learning environment uh, which consists of some website style technological solution. Mm, the next is edoblog.com. This is very popular blog to use by thousands of educators to create and host teacher and student blog. The next is the blogger.com. This is extremely popular free blogging sites and also easy to use. That's all. Thank you.